Hey everyone, uh, here's a project that I built from an old projector. This is an ancient uh, LCD projector. So what I did is I took a standard desk lamp and removed the socket there and then replaced it with the uh, high intensity discharge lamp from the LCD projector. And I used the lamp's existing wiring. So let me turn this on. And uh, while it's warming up, I'll open the box up and show you what's uh, inside the box there. So I use this cardboard box as an enclosure just because uh, it was available and it's uh, cardboard's easy to work with. So here, here we have the two boards from the original projector and what I did was I bypassed the interlock here. It had both a thermal interlock and a mechanical switch interlock which I just shorted out. And then the actual power supply board for the lamp itself had a, an optical input on this side, and if you look closely uh, down at the uh, opto isolators there, you can see I've shorted one out so that the uh, power supply board thinks that it's always getting the signal to turn on. So surprisingly this lamp cord between the power supply and the lamp was able to withstand the high starting voltage. I think the starting voltage could be many kilovolts, uh, but after the arc strikes the voltage is pretty low and the current is high. And then I just used a lamp cord with a an inline switch here just to turn the whole mess on. So this is a 270 watt light. <laughs> Pretty bright. Um, let me just aim it up at the ceiling. Kind of see what that looks like. Let me stop the camera down a bit. So you can see compared to what the brightness of that fluorescent lamp there, the uh, spot from the from the uh, arc from the arc lamp is pretty bright. So I mounted the bulb in there uh, with some silicone tubing and some wire and the wire and silicone tubing can take the heat but the paint inside the lamp housing cannot. So after it runs for about five minutes uh, it starts to smoke and there's no cooling inside this cardboard box so after it runs for a few minutes I would suspect uh, it's going to be too warm in there too. So this is kind of a <laughs> sort of a funny project just to um, perhaps build a bat signal or something like that. Alright, see you next time. Bye.